This is a video showing the installation of a dual axis tracking system. This is a site, it's three miles south of Moran, Kansas. And the site was chosen for minimum shadowing from trees or buildings. And of course, as to the preference of the owners. Based on that site, we zeroed in on a exact location, which you can see is a yellow pin the house to the left is the owner's home. It was built 37 years ago, has a solar water heater on it, and is passive solar design. The first thing to do was to install the uh, pedestal. The pedestal is in the ground, surrounded by concrete, eight feet deep, and it's eight feet above the ground. The crew is ready to get going. Uh, unpacking the materials. We used a mini excavator to mount the head. We strapped it to the head and dropped it on the top of the pedestal. Then we set the mini excavator aside and went to work. First thing they did was the main support beam that goes from left to right. Here's a close-up of it. The support beam there with U-bolts holding it together and the tracking motor and mount underneath the main beam. Next thing was to install the rails and the struts. The struts are used to add wind load or strength to the installation. You can see the one there on the left, they're installing it, but the main thing to see here is the technicians on top carefully measuring to make sure that the panels will line up with the rails. Now they're all installed. You can see the struts have been bolted. We're now putting on panels. Now all the panels are there. You can see, and I'll zoom in here, you can see the little gray boxes. Those are uh, in-phase mini inverters that convert the direct current or DC power from the sun to AC power, which is compatible with the utilities and appliances in the house, but also with the utility company so that we can run the solar power backwards back to the utility and you receive a credit for it. Starting the electrical there. Up on top, I climb up on a ladder to show you the surface of the solar collectors. There it is finished. They're still wrapping up a few things, checking the every bolt and the wiring. The owner is there in front, anxious to get the power flowing to, for savings in his utility bill. Here is a control box, the one with the decals on it. And it's, if you want to think of it that way, it's the brains of the system that tells it which way the sun is from morning till evening, from winter to summer or spring and fall in between. The owner is here at his dining room table. To his left is a envoy, which reads out how much power the solar system is generating at any moment or any hour or any day or any week or month or year. It allows him to tally his savings. The, the installation was observed and written up by the Iola, Kansas Register. Nice publicity for solar and for sustainability. And as they say in the cartoons, or as they used to say, that's all for now, folks. Thank you.